I'm glad you could come collude with me today. I feel very strongly about perfecting our organization and becoming the best mascots we can be. Now I realize these words have never been uttered before, but that mulch Schlitzman knows too much. Agreed. He's been revealing our trade secrets. He has an even bigger mouth than that talking salmon I had for lunch. That sounds delicious. Yes, I say our best plan is to go with plan A. So, you're saying we bust out the brain-erasing super silo? <laughs> Nothing so extreme. Could you imagine having all of your memories erased? No, and it would be a waste. I say we harvest his brain's parts and use what we can. Think of all the undiscovered potential in there. So, you're saying we recycle his overpowering self-confidence and extract just the privileged information? Not only that, we trap his self-improvement drive into a hyperbolic time chamber to create the perfect metaphor. We'll be winners. And what of the rest of his remains? Why, any brain cells that we cannot use we'll throw in our compost pile, of course. Or... Or... We give him a puzzle so mind-numbing, tedious, and overbearing that his neurotic ego won't be able to walk away. Wow! I tried giving Mark the traditional bagging, but he didn't fit! Blackjack, what the deuce? You had one job! It's okay. He brought us home. Are you still going mini golfing? I'm here to fight. Huh? I'm afraid not. Mr. Schlitzman, some of these are heirloom, and some of these are GMO. Can you spot the difference? Some of these are lentils! You maniac! You monster! We're going mini golfing. Have a loco day. <laughs> Why, why is the bag back on your head? It's more challenging this way. <laughs> oh, finger food. Oh. Curse you. Curse you both and your tiny beanness. Mm. Ha! No. I'm disappointed, Gato. You're acting brainwashed. You gained your fame at a grave, insane cost. If you aid their main boss, they'll raid the stage and cremate your stray thoughts. Walt, get up. We have work to do. But I'm almost done! Is that a dick? <laughs>